this light you're seeing right behind me this light above those lights are the solar powered lights that were newly installed in lagos and these lights are actually doing their job because if you notice previously in lagos like drivers don't even wait for the red sign the green sign yellow sign they don't care as long as the road is free they move the speed but after the installation of these lights which comes with cctv 24 hours coverage everyone is kind of like being careful even the town for drivers those popular yellow buses that they don't care what your traffic lights is saying they will move they are now beginning to pay attention and avoid queries and that is why this thing is very very important There's something I actually noticed about this light, which is it has changed the behaviors of drivers. And for the camera, I know most of us didn't actually believe it that the cameras are working 24 hours. These cameras are actually working. I'll show you the old pole, don't worry. The old poles which were removed and these new lights were installed. They are all still there, they have not been removed. They just for they lay them down on the floor. There, I'll show you. Let me just see a place where I could cross, then I'll show you. So this new one has a space in the pool where the battery are stored. So as long as the, the, the light is charged, the battery, the reserve is charged, the camera is also powered with the same battery. And you know these cameras are very, very light. They consume very low amount of energy and that is something these people actually plan to do. And it actually works because as long as the camera, the light is on, the camera is on. So that is it. The light charged during the day and turns on at night every day. So let me cross, um, I'm a bit close, let me just cross and I'll show you the previous poles, they were black but these ones now are silver in color, so I'll show you. Fast, 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 vehicles are not coming now. Let me just cross. Okay, let me turn the camera. So if you look right here, this is the old pole laying down. This is the old pole right there. So there are so many of them lying down just like this one. This is the new ones. These are the old ones. So we have to cross back. At Victoria Island. And we are close to Odeku area. And if you notice, you will see that these new street lights that are all installed here, they are all solar powered. And which means this light can be charged with sun during the day and also we have a reserve battery where they store energy and by the end of the day which when it comes to night they turns on automatically but now there's something people most people don't know about this light that there's something i'm going to show you now when they were installing these lights i made a video actually and I told the viewer that this light has a um, CCTV camera in them and it's 24 hours but nobody actually like got to agree with us on the comment section people asked if the camera were even going to work after all it's Nigeria but this is not a joke because when you look at this light you will see that the cameras are underneath them it's right beneath the light. and as long as the battery on the light the reserve battery is charged the camera is also charged so the camera is still using the same 
fact to the same energy source in the light and that is also the main reason why you notice these vehicles they stop at the red sign and move at the green sign usually in lagos it's very very hard for people to like obey traffic signs traffic navigation everybody when it's red they move when it's green they still move but because of this camera which also captures plates longer people are beginning to obey the traffic signs and nobody wants to walk it so i'll also show you more concerning this place in a bit